I've been putting this off for over a year now. And so I got this old TV that I found at an HOA complex and I took it home, barely tested it, just turned it on, saw it work, voila. Next step is what I wanted to do is I wanted to get an industrial TV cart. Couldn't find that. Obviously if I waited a little bit longer, I could get it, but we're balling on a budget right now. So I went to Target and they had this weird ass kitchen thing. So the theory and, and purpose is we're gonna build this put TV on top of it. Then we put some game consoles under it because nostalgia is very important to me and I want to play some of my old ass consoles. Hope you guys enjoy this. Let's get into it. I didn't want to continue to have a CRT sitting in this collection room that rarely anybody is going to touch but me on an occasional month or two. So this was the main reason why I wanted to make this. Something that I could roll out to the living room and the same that many of you guys can do as well. Just go find a TV on OfferUp or something that you already have in your house and get a storage shelf and put it on it, put your consoles on it and roll it out and have some fun memories with your family again. Alright so we got the TV on this bad boy and we had to ratchet this stuff down because it's very sketch. This is obviously that $30 target crap that I was talking about but surprisingly it moves pretty decently a couple other modifications I made was we put this on there which is a universal something dongle power supply and I just I don't even know what you call that what do you call that Velcro we velcroed it we velcroed it so this we plug the TV into the bad boy we plug it into the wall thankfully we turn this bad boy on it turns on. Now, because of old ass TVs, I didn't take into account that we need a stupid ass universal remote. So we gotta go to Walmart and get one. And now we're gonna come back and try to get this shit to work. But of course, on to Walmart. We just got these bad boys, essential. Uh, also recovering from the, the teeth uh, and food socks. So we balling on a budget. Then we got ourselves the remote. So now we're gonna go and test that bad boy. Let's get it! People try to say that I need to get out of the 2000s and that I just need to grow up and that I'm acting like a boomer. Fucking shamrock shake. Where's the cherry? Literally cutting corners, guys. They're not putting cherries in here. There's no cherry shortage or whatever. If you look at my shamrock shake on Google, this shit comes with a fucking cherry. Back to the program. So the next step is to time lapse this. See how long it's gonna take me to figure this shit out. Let's do this. That went pretty fast, so now we gotta turn this on. And now we gotta find the input. I literally got the dumbest remote. I don't know how to other home. It. Oh, maybe the fucking button at the top that says input. <laughs> audio but no video let's fucking go that's what we got on this bad boy dude it's so bad it's like bad in a good way this has a 13.5 gigabyte hard disk on the top Bro, there's some fucking maps on here. Me and Mo? Bro, there's some sexy project. There's some good ass stuff on here. Holy shit, I kinda wanna get to the bottom of this. So as you can see now, the whole setup, we gotta get a universal remote. This is the most important thing, guys. You need to go out and get a universal remote if you find some junk TV and got this nice $35 sort of dolly. Could have gone a little bit more, but I think for what it's gonna do, it's good. Uh, we lucked out and we got this uh, kind of ratchet thing to kind of hold it down, which I think is a key important thing with something cheap like this. You want something to keep it propped. And then on the back, we have the console hooked up to this, so then we could just kind of take it anywhere and plug it in. And as you can see, bada bing, bada boom, that works. I want you guys to tag me in any of your projects that you make that are similar to this. I'd love to see them on TikTok or on YouTube. Massage is very important to me. And until then, see you on the next video.